I don't know. All right, guys, for the uh, just the kind of hell of it, we're cutting up the old orange truck. We're gonna be ripping the motor out, dropping the gas tank, cutting it in half. Um, I don't know if we'll get it all done today, but we're gonna sure work as fast as we can. So uh, let's get into this. Hi -ya! Upside down! Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. You're gonna love what I'm thinking about doing with the uh, transmission cross number. Uh, fuck! What? There's this thing called the fucking drive shaft in the way. Oh, yeah, but get this way. Hey, nope, we can't get it that way either. You guys cut it down here, right? <laughs> Gotta have the Oh fuck it the tailpipe now <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yep, I need better. Yeah. Must be one of those cheap no lucky batteries, not my off brand ones. Nope. Oh that's an off brand. I did use that one for that because you did. La 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 can we, can we heat up the side garage? Can we throw some heat in the side garage? It's cold. <laughs> God damn. Yeah, probably, it probably. probably not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, boom! We're a little temper, Angel. Sorry. You won't be coming home. <laughs> At least I died in my coffin. <laughs> oh, it's like, oh, no power! Pull it off. There's nothing really left of it. Wow, the bolt came out. Where'd you cut that? No, I cut it. Okay. What's the next part? Uh, lower it and then we'll see how far she falls. Are you kidding me? Oops, stop. Crap. Rest it on there. Grab me a pro bar. It's scary, that's all that holds the fucking gas tank on. You don't think there's any straps? Nope. Or any uh, brackets to hold it? Nope. All you got is those two straps. You guys kind of hold through the floor and beat it. Ready? Yep. Okay. Alright, lower it. Alright, heel. Yep. Oh, I'm 
probably gonna be more weight in the ass than yeah. oh, Alright, keep going slowly. Once we get the S out on the ground, we can just get it from there. Oh, but I think our hoses are holding this up. Ready? See what we got up here. Oh yeah, our hoses are like banjo strings. Okay. Ready to cut them from this side there? Think that'd be good. You can't cut them with that cutoff wheel. Why's that? You're cutting and throwing sparks into a gas tank. Well, they're only rubber. Yeah, but they go into the gas tank. <laughs> I smell gas. Yeah, me too, a little bit. Oh, do that. You gotta use a knife. Huh. A can knife. A can knife. A can knife. Okay. Can you go and see up on top there? Yeah. yeah. Or can you go? Well, I only can get the small one. The breather. Yeah, if you get the big, I can get the big one over here. Yeah. All right, I can get the small one. Give me a knife. Your can knife. Can I? Can I? I got twenty out knife is small. Can I? English is weird. No, English is fucked up. Uh, and you got hookers. Damn it, knife one. I just sharpened this thing too. I wish I could get this on tape. Ass is on the ground. Oh. Keep going, keep it going, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's good. I thought it was. Yep, push. Keep pushing. Hold on, I can make this up. Right there. Oh, now I gotta cut these. He's probably gonna be on them. You got a vice grip? Give me a big pair of vice grips. A big wide pair and I can hold this hose closed. Vice grips. Uh, and I can hold the main fuel hose closed. Yeah, hold on. How the fuck are we getting this thing out of here? Uh, <laughs> what? A big pair. Hey, we ripped off a fuel line. I figure what we do is jack up the rear end until it clears and I'll go get this thing out. Get the engine hoist. Yep. I don't know if you can get it. Pretty shitty pair. Now these are the ones you just broke the spring on. No. Uh, You're gonna clamp it from your side. I don't know, no, you can't. Can we get this thing out? I can't reach it from my side. Where's You're good. It right here. Oh, I don't have to clamp it that far. Can you get to it now? Go down. Go right down here. have a less likely of it spilling out. That the fucking big hole fuel could come out of that pretty darn quick. Oh, got yeah, fuel. What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's the main fuel line. The light's so bright, shining back into my eyes. If I can't get these lines. God damn it. There's two of them. There's one more. Yep. Oh, that one's not even attached. Great. Not anymore. You're literally ripping them off. Literally just 
ripping the lines right out. Good. Well, it's a good thing his truck's getting retired. Hook it up, Andrew. Rad I told this thing one day it broke down. I'm going to fucking take it to the scrapyard. I don't have my word. I know. So, might as well come when we're doing it, right? Yep. Careful of your plies. Woo now, that's how you properly rip off a bumper. Yep. Oh, it wasn't much left anyway. I mean, look at this piece right here isn't even attached. Look at that. Look at that. There's so much rust I can... Hello from the other side! Boy, it's a mess in here, isn't it? I know. You need clean. I know. Good little plastic cutter. <clears throat> Alright guys, today, this is day two of taking apart the orange truck. Um, Yesterday we took care of the uh, engine mount bolts and uh, we tore the whole front end off here and so we're just going to keep on trucking. Um, I went ahead and cut the transmission cross members and the drive shaft and there's uh, the floor jack holding up the transmission and there's the drive shaft and let's see if I can get a shot. Engine mounts or the transmission mounts. I don't know. Well, we got those cut, so it's almost ready to come out. So we're gonna go ahead and clip a few wires and pick this thing up.
missing some scuff. There we go. Go ahead, Andrew. <laughs> <laughs>